let me first start and say what day it is. So it is the night before Thanksgiving and I just went food shopping. That's all the groceries over there. And I currently have the Hallmark Christmas Channel on. It's commercial, so sorry if it's like really loud and obnoxious. But anyways, Riverdale is on in like 30 minutes. And I thought while I wait for Riverdale to come on, I'm going to start my casseroles for Thanksgiving. And I know every year I'm always Snapchatting all the casseroles I'm making. But this year I thought it would be lovely to show you what I'm making for Thanksgiving and kind of give you like a general idea on like what kind of casseroles I make. Yeah, so let's get started. So the first thing I'm making is this broccoli casserole. And the second casserole I'm making is this creamy green bean casserole. Sorry if the focus is weird. I don't like mushroom soup or mushrooms by any means. So I always Google um, the creamiest green bean casserole with no cream of soup, meaning like with no mushroom soup. So this is the recipe without mushroom. So right now we're going to start with the broccoli casserole and we're just filling up this pot with water all the way to the middle. So right now I have the broccoli soaking in the water and I'm waiting for it to boil. While I'm waiting for it to boil, I'm gonna start the sauce for my green bean casserole. The creamy sauce that's not mushroom soup. So it says to add three tablespoons of butter and while it's melting to add some flour to make it a creamy consistency. So we're gonna try this. I'm gonna use this cute little snowflake spatula to mix this together. Right now, I'm going to add some chicken broth, and it doesn't say that in the recipe I use, but my mom taught me this trick for like the creamy sauce. Woo! So this is what the creamy sauce looks like. I still have to add some more chicken broth, but I feel like it looks like I'm making barf for Thanksgiving right now. And now I'm adding some minced onions to this cream. That looks so good, it smells so good. Wow, this reminds me of like oniony mashed potatoes. I make this casserole every year, so if anyone's gonna comment down below that it doesn't look great or whatnot, this is how I make it, so yeah. <laughs> so this is what it looks like now. And I know there's precise measurements for this recipe, but I'm cooking for like nine, maybe six to nine people, and this recipe only cooks for four, so. I'm just making an abundance of it so that everyone can have some. It says once this is cooling off to add some sour cream to make it a little creamier and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. While I wait for the cream to cool off and while I'm still waiting for the broccoli to boil, I just noticed that Riverdale is gonna be on, see look, snoozing, I had an alarm. Riverdale's gonna be on in five minutes, so we better get watching that. <laughs> Colin! So, we out. Oh, <laughs> you stubbed your toe? No, I banged my <laughs> Glad to see you laugh when I get hurt. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, that must have hurt real bad. So, <laughs> we just changed the channel to watch Riverdale. We realized that Riverdale is having a holiday break this week, and the next episode is playing next week and not tonight because mm -hmm. tomorrow's Thanksgiving. <sighs> we're really disappointed because we're huge Bughead fans. I want to see the killer is. I know, the black one. So, so, I did start opening the green beans for the green bean casserole. And these cans weirdly have handles, but these two cans don't, and I don't have a can opener. So we're gonna have to figure out how to open these. When you don't own a screwdriver. Your face, when you don't own a can opener. <laughs> I don't know what's more dumb, the fact that I called that a makeshift screwdriver, or the, fact, opening the or the fact that you're using a knife <laughs> and a hammer. This is what people do when they don't have a can opener. So I'm using this cute little vintage uh, casserole dish that I found in an antique store. Look how cute. I'm gonna start by putting a layer of this creamy uh, mixture down. And I'm gonna spread it. It looks like this. It doesn't matter if it's like perfect. Just spread it out everywhere. Now I just added some green beans and then I'm gonna add another layer of this. So now I'm just gonna mix that creamy stuff in with the green beans that I put in 
to the casserole over top. Okay, so my green bean casserole looks like this, and now I'm going to add a layer of those crunchy onion crisps that you put on top of salad. So now I'm gonna pop this baby into the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes for 350 degrees. I love this. While I put the green bean casserole in the oven, the broccoli just started boiling, so I'm gonna turn this off and then I'm gonna dump this into that little strainer that the green beans were just in. Now that I'm done straining the broccoli, I'm going to put this in a bowl and I'm gonna mix the cheese in there with it. So I just had Colin come open these for me and now I'm just gonna put the cheese all over the broccoli. That looks Amazing. Because these are two smaller casserole dishes, I split the casserole up into two dishes, and now I'm gonna work on the toppings. For the toppings, I have crushed up some Ritz crackers, and I'm going to place them onto the stove, the same skillet that I used to make the cream for the green bean casserole, and I'm melting some butter and I'm just gonna saute the crushed crackers and make them crunchier and saltier for the toppings. So I just added the sauteed buttered Ritz crackers to the top and now I'm gonna add a layer of cheese. So it should look like this before you put it in the oven. Oh my God, they look so beautiful. And the green bean casserole was done as soon as I finished these. So now I'm gonna pop those in the oven with the same heat from the green bean casserole. Hey guys, good morning. It is turkey day. I just got done doing my makeup. I need to clean up this mess on my vanity. Um, but yeah, I'm about to spend the first half of Thanksgiving with Colin's family and then the second half with my family because my family doesn't eat dinner till like way, way later. So right now I'm going to uh, have some early dinner with Colin's parents and around like 4.35, I'm going to change and bring my casseroles to my parents. And we're gonna have some Thanksgiving celebrations there with like Nikki, Nate, my parents, my older sister, my younger brother. You're gonna get to meet all of them. Hey fancy babies, so I'm at my parents and I'm in my dress for Thanksgiving. So I just found out that my older sister isn't gonna be here and I didn't know that, so I'm a little bummed, but at least Nikki and Nate are here and my younger brother, which you will most likely be meeting in this vlog. He's, he's something else. Those of you who have stuck around fancy vlogs for a little bit have seen him in previous vlogs. But guys, look how cute. I've been decorating for Pink Wonderland. Um, I feel like it's going pretty well. And this is my vanity right now. I'm so excited to do a room tour for Pink Wonderland this year. I do have a lot of cleaning up to do, but you should be expecting the Pink Wonderland room tour in December, like early December. I am going to LA next week. The fancy vlogs are gonna be in my LA bedroom next week and I'm decorating that for Christmas. So I feel like there's gonna be a lot of like Christmassy bedroom tours on this channel since I basically have like three bedrooms. So this is what my dress looks like and I am wearing shorts underneath because it keeps opening up and I don't wanna flash my family. But yeah, I got this from Reformation. It kind of looks like a night robe in real life, but on the model it looked like a casual pretty dress. So I'm a little mad that it looks like I'm wearing a nightgown to dinner, but at the same time it is just my family that's gonna be at the dinner table. Lil wants to be a part of Thanksgiving. Oh my gosh. Get down. Get down. Girl, get down. So everyone's about to have my casseroles. Let's see how I did. Oh, so did someone just scoop one already? How is it? How are the casseroles? 10 out of 10. Which one was your Texture. favorite? Green bean. Oh, wow. So, <laughs> my green bean casserole. Isn't it the same thing? Hmm. Mm. The creamy texture <laughs> of the cream sauce is really good. And really? the broccoli casserole. <laughs> no, that's really good. I cried it myself. I think I did pretty good. I think you're great. really older. Thanks, baby. So <laughs> hey guys, so it is the next day, and I'm currently Black Friday shopping, and it is 
a madhouse. It is chaos. And as much as I want to whip out my camera and start like vlogging what it looks like, I'm scared people are gonna like notice that I'm filming them or, and get mad. So I'm gonna try to film what I can film. But so far, I went to Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret, and now I'm in this cute little glam store. And Nikki and I are gonna put up a haul with what we got at Black Friday on the Nikki and Gabby channel. So if you wanna see what I got, make sure to go there, you know. Nikki and I are about to film our annual Black Friday haul in this cute little setup in her room. How adorable is it? Um, I would show you guys what I got, but you know, you gotta watch the Nikki and Gabby channel, and I'll link that down below. Hey guys, so guess where me and Colin are headed to right now? We're headed to the dollar store. And do you wanna know why? Because we are just the weirdest couple ever and we're like you know what let's go to the dollar store and buy each other 10 random things and like see what they are and like they could be joking they could be serious but because it is black friday we were like i wonder what is going on in the dollar store on black friday like are things 50 cents like <laughs> like what kind of deals would there be but honestly there's probably no deals at the dollar store but we just want to go in there and See what kind of presents we could get each other. Baby, I'm getting you 10 presents today. You're spoiled. <laughs> oh, I can't wait. It's the dollar store. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be fun. Let's All right, go. let's go. Yeah. <laughs> we have to go in different aisles. Yeah, I'll see ya. Hmm. Hmm. I'm actually finding stuff that Colin will actually use. I wonder what he's getting me. Okay, so we're back home and I have no idea what he got me. I feel like this is like a fun challenge to do for like a regular YouTube video, but this mm -hmm. is just a vlog. We're just in a really weird relationship. Like this is what we do for fun. Please no hate in the comments about how it's insensitive to shop at the dollar store for a challenge. I know I've seen those kind of comments before, but we actually shop at the dollar store for some things sometimes. We're not making fun of it by any means. It's just like Black Friday. We wanted to just see if there was any sales to begin with, because like, yeah, that would've been so funny. Were there any sales? No. no. But that's okay, we, we had right, a great- Go first. Here. Screw, I can actually use these. Screwdriver set. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's actually useful. I feel like there was so many more things that like you could get me that I can get you. Yeah, I like, easily was... got you stuff. Yeah. Ooh, wait, this is useful because I always run out of hairbrushes. You know yeah, this. Yeah, that's why yours is all tangled with hair, so I got you a new one. <laughs> Thanks, babe. You're welcome. I'll use mine. On what? <laughs> The USB charger? Oh, this is so exciting. It's clothing. not even for the iPhone. Oh, it's it's not? for Android. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be good for my Sony. Android. Oh my god. Okay. I bear children. Aww. It's cute. You like it? Yes, Colin. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> yeah, it's really cute though. Like, I really I love baby dolls. <laughs> it's squishy. It's actually really comfy. Yeah. When I was little, I always lived with baby dolls. Like, I couldn't fall asleep without a baby doll when I was little. So that, that's actually good too. Socks! Ooh. Love new socks. Yeah. I actually don't mind getting socks You're for like gifts. You're always looking for socks. I love socks. You always lose I your socks. I love socks. All right. Lily can't even eat this. Why? A pig ear, she'll choke on it. She's like it's 10 pounds. It's a pig ear. It's a toy. Okay. You can give Thanks, it to her. Baby. You can give it to Lily. It's a little. <laughs> oh, a screen cleaning set. He, you can clean your phone screen. Thank you. I can use this because my phone is always filthy with fingerprints and stuff. There you go. Wait, I love LA colors. So Dead I ass. Like, I'm just gonna get it because it's, it looks like something you'd wear. No, LA colors has the one of the best eyeshadow palettes, and I think this is this this is the one. I think. Really? Even it has like store? every shade. Hold on. Yes. That's why it's such like a mind fuck to beauty gurus. They're like, why do they sell this? Nothing against the dollar store, but this I feel like is worth a lot. Because this palette so many people use. It works so well. Oh my god, I'm actually gonna put this in my travel bag. Really? Thanks, baby. Yeah. Good. I leave for LA soon, so. 
<laughs> shower cap. I got you a shower cap as well. <laughs> wow, we were both thinking of the shower. Ooh, that's, it's pink. Oh, I used to use these all the time. Throwback old Gabby videos. I used to use this thing, remember? You look cute. Thank you. Why do you look like Rihanna with that thing on? What? <laughs> your profile, you look like freaking Rihanna. Put it up like that, put it up over your head, and do the side. I think you look like Rihanna. What the heck? You're weird. <laughs> <laughs> Tweezers. Alright, I got you Reese's Miniatures. Oh, thanks, babe. This is my favorite candy, guys. Those of you who remember when I went on tour. More socks. More socks. <gasps> Thank you. Oh, wait, these are cute. I know. Oh my god, they're adorable. Are they for like little girls though? I don't know. They might fit your hands, regardless. Yeah, they'll fit. I have little girls. They're hands. cute, like the pink fur. So you. It's so cute. Thank you. Oh my gosh. For my car. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Thank you. I'm actually gonna need this because it snows so much in PA. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> oh. I love mugs. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I love mugs. If you broke it. Like. Have a Merry Christmas, ho, 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 merry and bright. <laughs> it's cute. It's so Christmassy and festive. I'm trying to get you things that you can put to use. Same. Oh, thank you. Dang, I didn't know that we had these at the dollar store. <laughs> can't you. take you seriously. <laughs> thank you, baby. Like a frame or like of the picture? Nope. It's just a picture. Wall art. <laughs> Colin, at first we were taking this you out. Like if you look at like look like this, I thought it was like a fish smiling. Let me see. Just the nostrils and the mouth. Are those are the eye? That's a scary ass fish. Yeah, I thought it was a fish smiling. That's and I'm a scary like, fish. What? What is this? Oh yeah. I love this game. It's one of those little with mini games. Thank you. I need it like that. Okay. Fresh balsam. Mmm. I think the best smell of candle ever. Get it on my tooth. Smells really good. It smells very Christmassy. I really like this. Mmm. Thanks, baby. I really like that. Thank you. <laughs> Colgate. I love the dollar store. <laughs> Me too. I actually do. Get you a book. You can listen to it. Is this a joke or no. did you get this for me because it says I love you more? That's why I got it. I didn't open the book. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And I also got this out of the quarter machine where you put a quarter in and you get a random thing. Is this for me? I don't know what it is. Yes. Handcuffs. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm going to wrap this vlog up. It was a little interesting. I'll see you guys in my next fancy vlog and I hope you enjoyed this one. And my special, special boyfriend. Bye! Bye. <laughs>